The 2E10 Design Buggy Project is based on the design, implementation and operation of a buggy system under wireless supervisory control. It is a combination of electrical and computer engineering. Teamwork and coordinated problem solving are essential. Our project was based on the idea of the Lewis tram system in Dublin. The buggy uses wireless communication from a base station to travel around a track and receive information from four separate gantries. There are various challenges that we as a group aimed to achieve, bronze, silver and gold respectively. The bronze challenge involves the buggy beginning in a parking bay, driving around the track twice and returning to the bay. The silver challenge is a step up from this and uses two buggies. The first buggy follows the track twice while the second buggy simultaneously, with communication between gantries and the base station, drives around it once. The gold challenge is the final and most important goal. It involves three buggies concurrently following the track this is our final goal. We split into two groups to complete the hardware and software elements of the project. For the hardware, the motor controller circuit had to be carefully designed and constructed. After drawing a schematic diagram, the components were soldered onto the copper strip wood. Initially, the buggy scans the area around it, recording the highest and lowest levels of infrared. From that, it can tell if its sensors are over black or white. Once calibrated, it sends a question mark to the base station. Then it dynamically allocates it a buggy number and a set of rules. Once all buggies are set, the PC sends a go command to the first buggy and updates its position on the map. The PC continuously receives the buggy's location, updating its position and permissions. When the buggies wait, its, inf its info box and icon on the map goes red. When it's going, they go green and when it's finished, it goes yellow.